Alright. Let's begin. <clears throat> the legend of the Hirona begins in a rural village where a young woman named Maria lived. She came from a poor family, but was known around her village for her beauty. One day, an extremely wealthy nobleman traveled through her village. He stopped in his tracks when he saw Maria. Maria was charmed by him, and he was charmed by her beauty. So when he proposed to her, she immediately accepted. Maria's family was thrilled that she was marrying into wealth, but the nobleman's father was extremely disappointed that his son was marrying into poverty. Maria and her new husband built a house in the village to be away from his disapproving father. Eventually, she gave birth to two sons. Her husband was always traveling and began to stop spending time with his family. When he came home, he only paid attention to his sons, and Maria knew her husband was falling out of love with her. One day, he returned to the village with a younger woman and told his sons farewell, ignoring Maria. Maria, angry and hurt, took her children to the river and drowned them in blind rage. She realized what she had done and searched for them, but the river had already carried them away. Days later, she was found dead on the river bank, challenged at the gates of heaven for the whereabouts of her children. She was not permitted to enter the afterlife until she finds them. Stuck between the land of the living and the dead, she spends eternity looking for her lost children. She is always heard weeping for her children, earning her the name La Llorona. It is said that if you hear her crying, you are to run the opposite way. If you hear her cries, they could bring you misfortune or even death. Many parents in Latin America use the story to scare their children from staring out too late. La Llorona kidnaps wandering children at night, mistaking them for her own. She begs the heavens for forgiveness and drowns the children she kidnaps. People who claim to have seen her say she appears at night or in the late evening by the rivers or lakes, wearing a white or black gown with a veil. Some believe those who hear her wails of La Llorona are marked by death or misfortune, similar to the Banshee legend. Among her wails, she is noted for crying, Ay, mis hijos, which translates to, Oh, my sons. She scrapes the bottom of the rivers and lakes, searching for her sons. It is said that when you hear her wails near, they are actually far. And when she sounds distant, she is actually near. <laughs> well, that's it. See you guys next time. Bye.